friends and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to do something a little bit different than like a travel -y video and show you my Sunday reset routine here in Italy. It's actually like my first time really having like a Sunday reset routine because before I came here I would work basically every Sunday so it's really fun to have like free Sundays now um, and just have like regular weekends because I, I used to work like school during the week and then work on the weekends and I don't know now I don't have a job here in Italy which has, has its pros and cons but one of its pros is free weekends so that's really nice and I really like being able to have a little you know do something fun on Saturdays and then have a little reset routine on Sundays so I'm gonna take you through that I just woke up and like made my bed all of that and now the first thing I am going to do this morning is shower and I'm gonna do like a full shower like hair wash exfoliate the whole nine yards shower because it is Sunday and I do desperately need to do all of those things like wash my hair exfoliate all that stuff needs to be done and i thought what better th time to do that than sunday this is usually how my sunday mornings go i guess cleaning is a big part of my sundays cleaning me making sure i'm clean cleaning my room i'm gonna do that after i shower yeah having a physically clean body and a physically clean space just really helps to set me up for the rest of the week and is a really great thing to do on a Sunday reset. I will see you after my shower. All right, I'm now all clean and freshly showered. I feel amazing. And next, I'm actually really hungry. So I think I'm gonna go and make breakfast now and make my coffee in the morning. That's something I kind of do with my reset routines, but also my morning routine, my night routine. For me, it's less like, okay, I do this, then this, then this, and this. For me, it's more like a to-do list. And I have the list of things I wanna get done, but it can get done in any order, basically. Um, just kind of whatever feels right. So like now I showered and then I'm hungry. If I wasn't hungry, I would have done something else first and then gone and eaten once I was hungry, but I don't know, I'm really hungry this morning. So we're gonna do that first. Just I just kind of do whatever feels right and then make sure I get everything done in whatever order I feel like. Okay, let's go eat and make coffee. I just ate that avocado toast. It was so good. I'm so happy. And what I want to do now is clean my room. It's not too messy. There's really just this lovely pile of laundry I have to deal with and a couple of other things. But I just feel like I really just need to straighten up my room a little bit so that I'm able to have like a clear mind. Because then I have to do a lot of homework and stuff later. So I need to have 
you know, clean space equals clean mind. So we need to get that done. Yeah, it's nothing too crazy. It's not super messy, but it just needs to be straightened up a little bit. So I'm gonna, I guess I'll time lapse that for y'all now. gonna kind of get that started do some like planning for my week any homework or studying i need to get done today and yeah we're just it's productive school time now let's get into it So I wrote out my little to-do list for today and then I created my weekly spreads for the next two weeks. Now, before I start doing the like actual productive stuff, um, I am going to do my nails. I've been doing like press-ons a lot lately and I have these, they're just plain pink ones, but this company impress they make really good ones that stay on for a really long time so hopefully i'll be able to wear these ones for like two weeks i don't know it says like don't wear them for more than a week so i usually change them out every week like usually on sundays for the past almost month i've been changing my nails every sunday it's another sunday thing but out of the two brands i've used really um this brand impress is really really good and they stay on super well and they do last very easily the full week whereas the other brand is a little not as good so i think i'm just gonna do that and i don't know I like the plain pink and also if i have nice fun long nails i'll be really tempted to do my homework because it's one of those it doesn't make sense i'm so aware of that but like if I get to like type on my computer with my nice long nails, I will sit there and do homework for hours because it'll be fun for me. I know it's stupid, but I'm, I'm going to do my nails real quick. Here's the final result. They look so good. They look so natural and they're like long, but not too long, like the perfect length. And they, they look so natural. I don't know. I think it's the pink color. That has been done. Now it is time to be productive and get some schoolwork done. I just have some studying to do. So yeah, we're just gonna get on that and be productive.
so I've just been studying for my history class for like about 45 minutes ish um right now I'm taking a little break um and then I'm going to study Italian for maybe another 20-30 minutes and then I'm getting hungry I don't know it's like three or something in the afternoon now um so I think after I'm gonna go to the grocery store um because I need to do some food shopping and then start cooking dinner I really like making like a big fancy meal big fancy meal um <laughs> but like buying food and like cooking on Sundays just to feel very homey and cozy so that yeah I have some like food ideas for the week so I need to go do my grocery shopping um we're gonna get that done after a little bit more studying so This is the um, green tea flavored Pocky. I'm so bad at opening these. That's okay. Alrighty, it is time to go to the grocery store and pick up a few things for the week. All right, you guys. So now that the grocery shopping has been done, that's basically everything that I needed to do today and was planning on doing for my little Sunday reset. Now it's like the evening and I'm honestly just gonna hang out for the rest of the evening currently about to play minecraft and maybe like watch a movie tv i don't know something just chill self-care but yeah that's basically what my sunday reset routine looks like it looks a little different every sunday but really what a sunday reset means to me is just having like a chill day to yes be productive but also just i don't know i really like my sundays now to be these relaxing days to prep me for the upcoming week. Um, Friday and Saturday are like the fun, busy days. And then yeah, some days are just like, for me, really chill days where I get a lot of stuff done and just do some fun stuff. Like I'll be playing Minecraft. I'll maybe watch a movie or TV show later. Um, I'll be cooking. It's just a day for kind of, for me, just chilling and kind of like a mental reset along with like a physical reset with cleaning my space and everything. But yeah that's kind of what i do on sundays so thank you so much for coming along with me on this little sunday reset vlog i will be making lots more little vlogs in the future this was very very fun to make and i hope you guys enjoyed bye i'll see you in the next one